As fascinating as the history of this country is, Welcome, period. kids aren't always interested in learning about the past. Did the Constitution set up the Supreme Court? Sometimes it's not that relatable for students, right? They didn't live in that era, they don't understand. Unfortunately, a lot of people miss this question. So Take it from John Cedio, who teaches U.S. history to eighth graders over at Briscoe Middle School. Sometimes you have to get creative. I know in my class, I like to keep them guessing. It's true. When you're in John's class, you never know what to expect. Maybe my room's set up in a weird way, or I'm wearing a costume. Over the years, John has collected quite the collection of historical costumes to help bring the past to life. Just a few years back, John decided to take it up a notch. Civil War time, Civil War rhyme. To bring history to life in a whole new way. This information for which I have a store will teach you all you need to know about the Civil War. It started when Congress began to disagree which state should have slaves and which should be free. Inspired by the musical Hamilton, John started writing, producing, and starring in his own rap videos about history. The abolitionists would not be down if you don't believe me. Asked John Brown. And his students loved them. It got bigger than I ever thought it would be. Um, and a lot of the ideas moving forward actually came from students. They even gave him his own rapper name. I am not Vanilla Ice. Call me Vanilla Fire. His videos gained the attention of educators around the school and soon around the country. Some other teachers that had seen things on social media and on YouTube were like, reached out and were like, hey, um, this is kind of cool. How do you do this? It was a clear black night. A clear white moon, angry mob on the streets, not prepared for the doom red coat. Things were going great, but deep down, John knew they could be better. And that's where Reiki Jimenez comes in. Hey, how's it going? A new friend who would help John to take his work to the next level. I'm a second year social studies teacher here at Briscoe Middle School. We're rolling. Reiki, who also has a background in video and film, loved what John was doing and wanted in. So they teamed up. So I hooked the left on purchase in Congress, met with Sam Adams, and I said, let's do this. That's when it happened. A spark, chemistry, whatever you want to call it, together their work began to soar. He's a vanilla fire, I'm Jay Knight. Producing videos to educate and inspire. Some original work and some song parodies. You ain't sure yet. But I'm born, yeah. I was like, this is, you know, this is, we got something good here. We have the ability to teach and have a fun time doing it. So I thought it was a no brainer. And I see you, win, see how you win. This is a corrupt bargain. And the students, well, they loved it. Definitely my favorite teacher. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He always finds a way to put things into like a fun perspective. It's very helpful because I have ADHD and, uh, I also have a bit of autism. Like he puts it in a type of way that makes me understand it more better. Very good, very good. What do we say for three about how it affects families? The best compliment that I can get every year from a student is, hey, I used to hate history and now I love it. Liberators, mount up. Writing, producing, shooting, and editing. It was a clear black night, a clear white moon, angry mob on the streets, not prepared for the doom. All on their own time, after hours. A party thrown by one of Boston's famous cliques. British tea and salt water on those famous nicks. I'm getting taxed, my business on stealth. It's a lot of work, but John and Reiki say it's worth it. We do it because we love it, and we do it because the kids love it, and at the end of the day, that's what matters most. If you know like I know, you don't want to step to this. The revolutionary era funked out with a gangster twist.